Hey there. I wanted to first thank you guys for all your feedback. You're amazing. Um, you brought up some points in your comments that I figured would be easier to explain in a video. So this is the original, um, one of the original files that I did. Uh, none of this is uh, a photo. Like I, it was all freehand drawn. Um, I used some brushes that were custom made uh, in Photoshop, like that had like leaf patterns and stuff to get the textures for the background um, and the deer. And uh, the rest of it, like these textured backgrounds were just downloaded like free uh, resource images and whatnot from like DeviantArt. But uh, starting with the background layers, this was basically where it started. I didn't know what to do with colors, so I tried this with it. Um, added some photo filters and then finally decided to just go with grayscale. Um, the actual original sketch uh, was something like this where I was going to have the deer uh, essentially blankly staring at the viewer but then um, I, I don't know how to draw deer very well. This had no references whatsoever when I tried this. Uh, then I found a YouTube video and the Google image search, like the still screenshot of it, he had a deer uh, in this pose. This was actually the original, um, just getting the lines down uh, using like a paintbrush, uh, very simple, just trying to flesh it out. Um, then I would, I went over it, like I added the hooves and that layer, um, I ended up not using this bottom layer, but uh, this actually was just the background. All it is is just little, um, it's hard to see, so I apologize, like Photoshop brushes uh, to create a textured pattern, um, to give it that appearance. Uh, and I, I played on like the light area here of the background that I already had. Um, so I'll add the hose back. Uh, that's the deer itself. This is, um, this is all painted in just one layer, uh, a couple different brushes, but you know, I just went over it and over it. Uh, I added the antlers. I didn't really add any text or anything, just a glow to it because I thought that would look interesting. Um, from there I added, it's hard to see, but like I tried to add a little bit of like blood from around the eyes and like nose or where the eyes would be. Um, that's the foreground is, uh, that sort of blurry, um, you know, the light shines on it, uh, in those trail cameras. Uh, so I did a little foreground there. Um, and that's, I mean, that was basically it. That was the whole thing is, uh, you know, no photos used. Um, you know, even the reference photo that I used, I don't actually paste down and like go over it, you know, line for line. Like I just kind of glanced at it as I was working. So I hope that helped answer any of your questions that you have about it. Sorry, it's a long video. I don't know how to explain my art, but thank you guys so much. I appreciate it.